we need a start finish line. Um, so for that we're going to do two things. Firstly we're going to draw the start finish line so it should be straight. We'll do we'll go with a red start finish line. Let's have it a bit thicker than that. Let's go with that. So let's say our start finish line should be there. Okay. And we also want it so that our car always starts here. So for that, we make sure the car is selected. And then we do another, so we click on events. When the green flag is clicked, let's move the car to about there. So let's try. So we put the cursor where we want and then we look at the X and Y just at the bottom right hand corner of the track. Mine current says minus 100, sorry, minus 18, 112. So let's see what that looks like. Minus 18, 112. Oh, that's a little bit too so I'm going clockwise, so I'm going right first. So let's move our x-axis a little bit further right. So this gets, let's try minus 10. Yeah, that's good. And also we want our car to be pointing directly right. So okay. Um, and I'll just move it down a little bit. So let's try 105, see what that looks like. Great. So then it doesn't matter where our car is, if we press this, it will go back to the start position. 